friends! Welcome back to today's video. Today we're going to be reading three Dr. Seuss books. The first book we're going to read is There's No Place Like Space. We're going to read Hand, Hand, Fingers, Thumb. And we're going to read One Fish, Two Fish, Red Fish, Blue Fish. Are you ready? Come on. And we have our friend here, Little Pink Owl. Hi, Owl. She's so cute, huh? There's no place like space. All about our solar system. There's no place like space. I'm the cat in the hat, and we're off to have fun. We'll visit the planets, the stars, and the sun. There is no place like space. I will prove it to you. Your mother will not mind at all if I do. So here comes the cat in the hat. And thing one and thing two. And there's that little goldfish too. Jump in, here we go. We will fly up so high. We can dance on the moon and play games in the sky. We will swing past the stars and in case you've missed them, you'll soon see. All right, so they're putting their spacesuits on. They're getting ready to go. The planets in our solar system. There are eight of these planets that circle the sun, and soon you'll be able to name every one. So I know that's the sun. Mercury is close to the sun's burning light. It's hot in the daytime, but freezing at night. Wow. I wonder what it'd be like to live on Mercury, huh? On Venus, the weather is always the same. Hot, dry, and windy with no chance of rain. Can you guess the next planet? Well, here is a clue. It is my home and home to thing one and thing two. You've been living on it each day since your birth. It's the third planet from the sun. It's our planet, Earth. It spins all the time, round and round like a top. It turns once every day and it will never stop. The question, this question had thing one and thing two in a tizzy. If the Earth's always spinning, why don't we feel dizzy? We don't feel the earth as it spins on its way because we're spinning right with it right now every day. Did you know that? The earth is always spinning, but we don't feel it. Next, here's Mars. It's the color of rust. We sneeze here because it is covered with dust. Travel to Jupiter and you will find it is bigger than all the other planets combined. So Jupiter's really big. Saturn has rings. It's so light, who would think? It could float in an ocean and not even sink. A planet can have satellites that surround it. Uranus has lots of these objects around it. There are colors in space. I will show some to you. Neptune, planet eight, is a beautiful blue. We have seen all the planets. Now here is a trick to remember their names and remember them quick. Say, Mallory, Valerie, Emily, Mickles, just saved up 999 nickels. So that stands for Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune. The first letters of these words is the same as the first letter in each of the planets you name. Now here is a game you can play in the skies. Connect all the stars you can see with your eyes. That's called the great dog, the great bear, Orion. It's the star dot to dot. Use your imaginations and you'll see big pictures we'll call constellations. This is called the bull and this is called the lion. A dog, the great bear, and Leo the lion. 
Taurus the Bull and a Hunter Orion. A star in the sky may look small like a dot, but it's really a big glowing ball and it's hot. And there's one star by far that's our favorite one. We can't live without it, a star called the sun. From the earth it looks big, there's one reason why. It's the closest to earth of the stars in the sky. But be careful and never look right at the sun. Your eyes would get hurt and that would not be fun. How big is the sun? We just heard right this minute, a million of our earths could all fit right in it. That's a lot. Oh, look at the time. We must go very soon, but first we must take a quick look at the moon. The moon does not shine in the sky in the night, but like a big mirror reflects the sun's light. Astronauts flew to the moon to explore a place no one had ever been to before. They walked on the moon and then drove all over in a special moon car called a lunar rover. An astronomer studies what's up in the sky. Thing two wants to be one. In fact, so do I. The universe is a mysterious place. We are only just learning what happens in space. So I brought you a present to look in the sky. Just put this telescope up to your eye. Oh dear, I must go. Fly back to the stars and take things one and thing two out to dinner on Mars. But there's lots to discover and it might be you who lo looks up in the sky and find something that's new. Wow, they're using the telescope. Oh, and this is the glossary. It lists astronaut, astronomer, constellation, lunar rover, satellite, solar system, a telescope, the universe. All done. Okay, let's read. Oh, I knocked over the owl. Sorry, y'all. Let's read hand, hand, fingers, thumb. Hand, hand, fingers, thumb. One thumb, one thumb, drumming on a drum. One hand, two hands, drumming on a drum. Dum, diddy, dum, diddy, dum, dum, dum. See, he's drumming. What a cute little monkey. Rings on fingers, rings on thumb. Drum, 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 drum. Monkeys drum and monkeys hum. Hum drum, hum drum, hum drum, hum. Hand picks an apple, hand picks a plum. Dum diddy, dum diddy, dum dum dum. Monkeys come and monkeys go. Hands with handkerchiefs blow, blow, blow. Hello Jack, hello Jake. Shake hands, shake hands, shake, shake, shake. Bye bye Jake, bye bye Jack. Dum diddy dum diddy whack whack whack. Hands play banjos, strum strum strum. Hands play fiddles, zum zum zum. Dum diddy dum diddy dum dum dum. Hand in hand, more monkeys come. Many more fingers, many more thumbs. Many more monkeys, many more drums. Millions of fingers, millions of thumbs, millions of monkeys drumming on drums. Dum diddy dum diddy dum dum dum. When I was little, this was my favorite book. I think it's so funny. And this is One Fish, Two Fish, Red Fish, Blue Fish by Dr. Seuss. Whoa. 
one fish, two fish, red fish, blue fish. One fish, two fish, red fish, blue fish. Black fish, blue fish, old fish, new fish. This one has a little star. This one has a little car. Say, what a lot of fish there are. Yes, some are red and some are blue. Some are old and some are new. Some are sad and some are glad. And some are very, very bad. Why are they sad and glad and bad? I do not know. Go ask your dad. Some are thin and some are fat. The fat one has a yellow hat. From there to here and here to there, funny things are everywhere. Here are some who like to run. They run for fun in the hot, hot sun. Oh me, oh my, oh me, oh my. What a lot of funny things go by. Some have two feet, some have four. Some have six feet and some have more. Where do they come from? I can't say, but I bet they have come a long, long way. We see them come, we see them go. Some are fast and some are slow. Some are high and some are low. Not one of them is like another. Don't ask us why, go ask your mother. Say, look at his fingers. One, two, three. How many fingers do I see? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. He has eleven. Eleven. This is something new. I wish I had eleven too. Bump, bump, bump. Did you ever ride a wump? We have a wump with just one hump. But we know a man called Mr. Gump. Mr. Gump has a seven hump wump. So if you like to go bump, bump, just jump on the hump of the wump of Gump. Who am I? My name is Ned. I do not like my little bed. This is no good. This is not right. My feet stick out of the bed all night. And when I pull them in, oh dear, my head sticks out of the bed up here. We like our bike, it is made for three. Our mic sits in back, you see. We like our mic, and this is why. Mike does all the, the work when the hills get high. Hello there, Ned, how do you do? Tell me, tell me, what is new? How are things in your little bed? What is new? Please tell me, Ned. I do not like this bed at all. A lot of things have come to call. A cow, a dog, a cat, a mouse. Oh, what a bed. Oh, what a house. Oh man, he's looking angry, huh? Oh dear, oh dear, I cannot hear. Will you please come over near? Will you please look in my ear? There must be something in there, I fear. Say, look, a bird was in your ear, but he is out, so have no fear. Again, your ear can hear, my dear. My hat is old, my teeth are gold. I have a bird I like to hold. My shoe is off, my foot is cold. My shoe is off, my foot is cold. I have a bird I like to hold. My hat is old, my teeth are gold. And now my story is all told. We took a look, we saw a nook. On his head, he had a hook. On his hook, he had a book. On his book was how to cook. We saw him sit and try to cook. He took a look at the book on the hook. But a nook can't read, so a nook can't cook. So, what good to a nook is a hook cookbook? The moon was out and we saw some sheep. We saw some sheep take a walk in their sleep. By the light of the moon, by the light of a star, they walked all night from near to far. I would never walk, I would take a car. I do not like this one so well. All he does is yell, yell, yell. I will not have this one about. When he comes in, I put him out. 
This one is quiet as a mouse. I'd like to have him in the house. At our house, we open cans. We have to open many cans. Is that, is, that is why we have a Zans. A Zans for cans is very good. Have you a Zans for cans? You should. I like to box how I like to box. So every day I box a gox. In yellow socks, I box my gox. I box in yellow, gox box socks. It is fun to sing if you sing with a ying. My ying can sing like anything. I sing high and my ying sings low. And we are not too bad, you know. This one, I think, is called a yink. He likes to wink. He likes to drink. He likes to drink and drink and drink. The thing he likes to drink is ink. The ink he likes to drink is pink. He likes to wink and drink pink ink. So if you have a lot of ink, then you should get a yink, I think. Hop, hop, hop. I am a yop. All I like to do is hop from finger top to finger top. I hop from left to right and then hop, hop. I hop right back again. I like to hop all day and night from right to left and left to right. Why do I like to hop, hop, hop? I do not know. Go ask your pop. Brush, 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 brush. Comb, 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 comb. Blue hair is fun to brush and comb. All girls who like to brush and comb should have a pet like this at home. Who is this pet? Say, he is wet. You never yet met a pet, I bet, as wet as they let this wet pet get. <laughs> it's a tongue twister. Did you ever fly a kite in bed? Did you ever walk with 10 cats on your head? Did you ever milk this kind of cow? Well, we can do it, we know how. If you never did, you should. These things are fun and fun is good. Hello, hello, are you there? Hello, I called you up to say hello. I said, hello, can you hear me, Joe? Oh no, I cannot hear your call. I cannot hear your call at all. This is not good, and I know why. A mouse has cut the wire. Goodbye. From near to far, from here to there, funny things are everywhere. These yellow pets are called the Zeds. They have one hair up on their heads. Their hair grows fast, so fast they say they need a haircut every day. Who am I? My name is Ish. On my hand, I have a dish. I have this dish to help me wish. When I wish to make a wish, I wave my hand with a big swish swish. Then I say, I wish for fish, and I get fish right on my dish. So, if you wish to wish a wish, you may swish for fish with my ish wish dish. At our house, we play out back. We play a game called Ring the Gack. Would you like to play this game? Come down, we have the only gack in town. Look what we found in the park, in the dark. We'll take him home, we'll call him Clark. He will live at our house, he will grow and grow. Will our mother like this? We don't know. And now, good night, it is time to sleep. So we will sleep with our pet, Zeep. Today is gone, today was fun, tomorrow is another one. Every day, from here to there, funny things are everywhere. The end. Wow, I had a lot of fun reading these Dr. Seuss books with you. Thanks for joining me today. I hope you all take care. Make sure to like and subscribe this video. And in the comment section below, tell me what books you think I should read next. I'm happy to take any suggestions. 
All right, until next time, bye.